time for my 11th John Carpenter Game Must Be Millionaire, the real cash prize edition for DVD. Adult sport, please. Hunterclid. What are protrusions for the sole of this band's boot known as? Stones? Sticks? Studs? Stars? They're studs. Well done, that's the right answer. Well done, Mr. Hunterclid. Which of the following bids Olympic debut at the 1988 Summer Games? Table football, table tennis, table setting, table dancing. It's table tennis. Very good, that's right, for 200 pounds. You've not used any lifelines, but they're all still available. If you need them, it's 300 pounds. 300 quid. In which city were the 1948 Summer Olympic Games held? Belfast, Galway, Edinburgh, or London? It's London. That's right, we have to quit. Let's get you up to 500 pounds with question number four. For 500 quid. Which of the sportsman was normally make use of a horse when competing? Cricketer, gymnast, footballer, golfer. It's a gymnast. Specifically, a pommel horse. For a thousand quid. Which Scotch football club is nicknamed the Boys? Celtic? Parts, Aberdeen, Rangers. That would be Celtic. You had 500 pounds, now you have 1,000 pounds. It's the right answer. Oh. <sighs> well, it really couldn't be very much better for you. Five correct answers, 1,000 pounds in the bank, and all your lifelines intact. And we're going to give you another one, our brand new Switch For 2,000 pounds. In which sport do teams compete for this trophy? Football? Rugby Union? Rugby League? Hockey? That would be football. You had 1,000 pounds. You just won 2,000 pounds. It's the correct answer. That's the uh, Champions League trophy. Very well done. You get to touch any of your lifelines and the correct answer here will win you 4,000 pounds. Lots of luck. For four thousand pounds. In two thousand four, which career became only the fourth in Test history to score ten thousand runs? Brian Lara, Sachin Tendulkar, Graham Thorpe, and Subman Uhak. That would be Brian Lara. Thorpe was actually uh, the fifth per cricketer to do so, and the youngest at the time. For eight thousand pounds, Tyne Castle is the home ground of which Scottish football club? Rangers, Hearts, Aberdeen, Motherwell. That would be Hots.
Things are getting a little more serious now. 16,000 pounds is a huge amount of money, and that's how much you can win by giving me a correct answer to question number nine. As the money goes up, the drops also go down. You can lose 7,000 pounds if you get this wrong answer. So think carefully before you give me your final answer. For 16,000 quid, what distance are competitors expected to swim during an Olympic triathlon? One and a half kilometers, three kilometers, five kilometers, seven and a half kilometers. That's one and a half kilometers. You're either very clever or very brave. If you can give me a tenth correct answer, you'll guarantee yourself 32. Look at how big the drop that the previous one, so it's a wrong answer will lose you 15,000 For 32,000 pounds, the Radcliffe Broden is a feature of which English cricket ground? Edge Boston, Trent Bridge, Lords, Headingley. That would be Trent Bridge. For 64,000 quid. What country did the winner of this match represent? Serbia? Croatia, Yugoslavia, Montenegro. It's Croatia. I know you have nothing to lose, but are you sure that the answer is correct? Yes. Hmm. Well, I hope the last special question has been a blessing for you. And it has. That was the right answer. It was one, a massive 64,000 pounds. That video was uh, Gordon Ivanovich defeating uh, Pat Rafter at the uh, 01, 2001 Wimbledon. For 125,000 pounds. Muhammad Ali is seen here defeating which of his opponents? George Foreman, Sonny Liston, Joe Frazier, Ernie Shavers. Is he staying on top of Sonny Liston? Yeah, that's a picture of the uh, rematch that they had in 1965. Right, let's look at where we are. If you give me a correct answer to the next question, you will win a quarter of a million pounds. So if you give me a wrong answer, you will lose 93,000 pounds. Let's make sure that you're not happy. Have a look. For a quarter of a million. In 1984, this band made his Formula 1 debut racing for which team? Tolman, Drabham, Surtees, Kojima. American Sam made his seventh debut driving for the uh, Tolman outfit. Yes. Team up with uh, Piancarlo Ginzami. Things couldn't be going any better 
if you just keep giving me the right answer, and I keep handing you bigger and bigger sums of money, and there is even more with that cable. Starting with a virtual check for £500,000, but only if you can find me the right answer to this question coming up. Remember, you still haven't used all your lifelines, which may come in very handy. Here it is. Half a million. The Cy Young Awards are awarded annually for excellence in which sport? Basketball, baseball, ice hockey, American football, it's in baseball. This is a very big moment in the game. Are you confident that's the answer you want to go for? Yes. You just risked £218,000. You had a quarter of a million pounds. You now have half a million. I bet you you were one of our biggest ever winners. It's for uh, the best starting pitcher in either the uh, American or National League. You have a real chance here to earn the virtual million. It's a rare thing to be asking a million pound question when you haven't used all your lifelines, but that is the enviable position that you were in at this moment, so enjoy it. I've got everything crossed and wish you the very best of luck. Here comes your final question. For one billion pounds. Which of these did this player not play in a singles match at Wimbledon in 2004? Serena Williams, Amir Moresmo, Amy Fraser, Lindsay Davenport. She didn't play Amir Moresmo. I have to check if you're really going to play this question. Is this your final answer? Yes. Okay, you're going to have to play this question. Yes. What a brave player. You have played the million pound question. There's now no going back, even though you did have the chance to walk away with a guaranteed half a million quid. I can tell you that by taking that chance, you will now be walking away with one million pounds. You are a winner! My 10th John Carver game on the adult sports section of, of the Real Cash Prize Edition. Thanks for watching.